Hello everybody, uh, I'm back. Um, <laughs> sorry about the lack of videos of the last uh, last couple of months. Um, basically, I've been busy redecorating my flat. And I'm all finished, thankfully. While I was decorating my flat though, I did actually manage to pick up a couple of, uh, a couple of new... Um, no, not I say new. A couple, <laughs> a few more figures. Um, a couple of which I've been looking on for for a while. Uh, and one I didn't even realise that actually existed. And here they are. We'll start with the least interesting one. So, Matt Smith with a beard. Um, it's your standard Doctor Who figure. The only difference is he's got a, uh, a slightly sculpted beard. Um, the articulation is pretty much the same as every as every figure so far. Uh, we've got arm joints that go up and down, elbow joints, mid-arm twists, wrist twisties. He can do the splits. Uh, he's got a mid-waist um, twist head joint and you can bend his legs. You also got a twist on the leg as well so you can spin it and he doesn't have any he doesn't have any uh, twistable feet. I really do like that like this figure but I'm not gonna get into too much detail he might you might see him again when I finally get to Matt Smith. Um, I found a, a destroyed Cassandra. Uh, this one um, is quite rusty. I don't know if this is um, like possibly a custom because um, this one seems like overly rusty uh, to me, but I really appreciate. Uh, I really like the uh, sort of like, like the overall aesthetic. Also, a bit grim, really, for a for a sort of uh, for a kid's toy um, to have them. A, essentially, a dead figure, someone who basically <laughs> exploded and ripped apart. But hey, you know, they must have had loads left in the uh, in the stock room and just thought, what can we do with this? So they decided to create destroyed Cassandra, which. Uh, Detailing is pretty much the same on both sides. You can kind of see the, uh, the, the her brain still in the jar through the cloudy uh, water. But I, I, it's just so, such a bizarre and odd thing that uh, that they made that I kind of love it in a way. Here is one of the figures that I've been looking for for a long, 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 long time. It's Toby Zed, but unpossessed. I've already done a review of Toby's Edge, which I really like. Uh, I, I, he's one of my favourite figures. I'm so happy that I've actually got the unpossessed version. Uh, he's still grimacing a little bit, which is a little bit of a shame. And the figure is 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 the same articulation, pretty much. Uh, but I really do like it. I, I I just love the fact that I finally got both of them. I mean, it took such a long time um, to get him, and here he is. I couldn't be more ecstatic. And finally, I didn't even realise they actually did Torchwood figures. And here's a Weevil. <laughs> from Torchwood. So I'm definitely going to be looking out for the rest of the Torchwood figures. I'm going to imagine they're not going to be cheap, uh, but I'm going to keep an eye out anyway. Um, his articulation is actually better than most of the uh, of the figures. You've got a ball joint for the shoulders, um, you've got an elbow joint. Uh, his elbows don't go all the way in, uh, which is a bit of a shame, but it gives the, gives the sort of more hunched over expression. Um, he's got a swivel um, on the elbow joint as well. He's got a he has got no neck. He's got. A, no. You can kind of see he's actually thing, but you can actually see he's got no neck joint there. Um, he can't do the Doctor Who splits, which is a bit of a shame. But he's got articulation to bring his knee up, uh, not very high. But yeah, I just couldn't believe it. So I'm going to keep an eye out for the rest of those. Um, this video is going to be well, just as short as the rest, to be honest. Um, but yes, I will be uploading again um, soon. I'm probably going to upload sort of twice a month this time, instead of once a month. Um, and hopefully I'm going to start trying to do different things with videos, get some better shots, get some better, get a better look of everything, uh, basically. So thanks for watching the video if you stayed till the end. Um, and I'm sorry again for the, uh, for the, for the delay. But yes, flat's all finished now. It's looking fantastic. Pretty much everything I want on, on display is on display. And I will catch you next time. Bye, Zs!